Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, welcome to Inspire Me Sunday. Um, I had a lovely day yesterday at the Horticulture Open Day at the Bridge End College because um, my husband um, is studying garden design and it was generally just nice to see, get the atmosphere. You know, there were stores selling plants. We didn't buy any. Um, and there were these adorable lambs. Uh, got to, and I mean, who does not love um, stroking lambs? Uh, so that was lovely. Um, it did inspire me a bit as well, because uh, they are doing sort of uh, gardening course, but more gardening course. Sorry, more on the design aspect. So that definitely um, got my interest. So I'm just I need gonna fill in a form literally for that to show some interest. Get some more information, um, yeah, and just see what happens with that. So, you know, there was a lovely homemade pasties there as well, because um, you know, you know me and my food. I always like my food, um, and that was nice. And yeah, we had a lovely time in IKEA too. Had the lovely meatballs, which we always have every time we go there, again in Cardiff, and we went to recreate, um, which is a brilliant. They do all sorts, really, it, but a lot of it can be used for arts and crafts. You know, you've got your usual paper, but then you've got the unusual stuff, like netting, for example. Um, it, it's just a treasure trove. Um, I love going there. You do need a bit of a gap, I find, because obviously he gets new stuff in, and there's just so much. But, yeah, you can have a really, you can have a good chat and a laugh there as well, so that's good. So I want to show you what I bought. Um, you've always got to watch the pounds there, because you could just go on and on. So the first thing I want to show you is this. I love this stamp. It's a gentleman stamp. So back in the old days, the gents, the five gents there with their top hats. Um, really good condition. Um, looks as though it's hardly been used. Um, they always do brilliant stamps um, at Recreate. Um, so if you're on, if you're on the Cardiff area, um, uh, South Wales. Recreate is definitely worth a stop. Um, I mean, this was three pounds, so but again, I I because I got a la a, a lady, so I thought go to gentleman to go with her. So that's uh, one thing. Now I got this brush. Um, I wanted this for decoupaging. Um, so it's got a nice you know nice bouncy bristle. Um, it's just got a nice little handle. And, um, yeah, so I got that, I think, 50p. Um, then I got these, actually, three embellishments. Um, so I got these crafty bits, some lovely little gems there, um, some nice uh, flower ribbon. Um, so that was lovely. I love the colour of that, like a rich chocolate. And I love these little ribbons. Again, just my style. Again, white, brown, little lacy. As I said, I love really nice. So again, exactly my sort of style. Um, now this was interesting. Um, this is textured, and it's, so it's this lovely shiny silver, almost metallic. But look at that lovely rust at the back. I mean, the texture on that and the pattern is just absolutely brilliant. As soon as I saw this, I knew I had to get this. Um, again, say 50p, but that was amazing. As soon as I saw that, loved it. Um, now, this is a bargain, £3. This bag of all different wools. It's got my favourite colours in it, like, you know, that lovely green at the top. Lovely sort of purples, greys, beiges. Yeah, it, it basically just me. It was just me all over. And like I said, all that for £3. So really, really good there. Can't wait to use that. Um, and yeah, so that's that part. Um, and I at last got myself... Oh, I'm not sure what you call these, but they're for... Um, you know, we want to clamp things. But look at... You know, I love how old some of them look. I mean, they look really old, even to the point of a bit rusty, some of them. But to me, that just adds to the um, crocodile clips, that's it. And I, as I said, I've, I've wanted these um, for a while, actually, decent ones. And these look like decent ones, you know, and old, which is even better. So that was cool, bag of them. 
um, more crafty bits here. These were nice. They were mini pictures, I thought. They were really sweet. Again, go lovely in a journal. Um, again, just um, stick them on at the back. Self, self, um, self sealant. Um, now, this, this material, guys, absolutely beautiful. I can believe my fi oh, found on this. Isn't that gorgeous? Chinese. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous material. Um, even I mean, it, both sides are gorgeous. I mean, which do you choose, really? Um, but it is absolutely stunning. Um, so yeah, and quite a lot of it as well. And and again, say a pound, it was just incredible. Absolutely beautiful because I do love the Japanese style. I think it's just stunning. Um, so I can't wait to play with this. Um, and I love this at the end as well stringy bits they're just absolutely brilliant um so well chuffed with that um last of all um i managed to find another beautiful uh sorry guys f flies oh dear peskin things um i do have to i'm not actually this book gonna be upside down <laughs> um is the Victorian photograph al album inspired by hearts and flowers. As you can see, absolutely beautiful inside. Um, I've got another one of these, and this is the second one I've managed to pick up. Um, I know trying to find, I do want to do something with this and the other one I got fam for my family and um, for my nieces, you know. Um, it is always a bit of a challenge of getting the right size photo. That's the only thing with these. But they're just so beautiful. Um, yeah, so a little heart at the back. Um, I think, again, it was 50p or pound or something silly like that. Um, but, yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, so that... Oh, and one more thing. I've always wanted to try a sew on a zip. I haven't tested myself with that yet. So, again, I thought I'd grab that, grab a zip. And see how I do with that. Um, so yeah, so that's my haul, guys. Yeah, so I was well chuffed with what I found and definitely inspired. And um, like I said, I'm always inspired um, to find things when I go to recreate. It's such a fantastic place. Okay, guys, well, thank you for joining me, and I shall see you next on Doodle Tuesday. Bye.